I was just uh, listening uh, an interview with Elon and this guy, I think it's Sap, Sam uh, Atman from the uh, Y Combinator. You know, this interview where you see like the, uh, the big uh, Uzin uh, at Tesla. And I realized that if you ask, why do you want to start uh, Firepress, Pascal? I would answer you something like, uh, because right now, if you want to create your own website, there is basically two major ways of doing it. First, uh, you would go do it yourself and you sign on uh, something like WordPress, uh, Square Wix, or whatever the product, and then you build it yourself, right? Do it yourself. And when you do this, you still have the problem of you need to organize your content, you need to get some pictures, you need to set up your logo, um, you need to design the workflow of how you're gonna uh, navigate a website. Uh, even if it's simple, I think you still need to think about that. And then the second way of doing it is basically going with the agency where um, you put all the problems in the, ed, uh, in the ends of a professional. And that requires much more money and usually uh, still time like that those kind of project like will occur for weeks and weeks so uh, that's my idea behind uh, firepress is to set up like an environment where for one day we're gonna take care of you we're gonna put together a photograph an infograph we're gonna put a copywriter and we're gonna put someone like me like a coach that will um, teach you how to use the platform which is ghost and at the end you have a website and you know how to uh, manage it by yourself and i think that's a very powerful thing and that's my hypothesis i think the idea that in one day you have your end product your website i think it's amazing uh if you compare by doing the do it yourself or the agency and uh much cheaper than the agency a bit higher than the with yourself but hey uh, you pay for the photograph you pay for infography and stuff like that so that's the core pitch I would tell to uh, an investor right now uh, if, if right now I had to pitch my idea to someone to get some money let's say and now I realize that at the bottom of my heart firepress is basically just one way of building this much bigger idea and or my, my my big vision right now is that or my my big faith in the world is that i need to help the world to gap uh to 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 bridge the gap between the uh poor and the health and and the wealthy people so statistics are showing that this gap is going uh, bigger and bigger right and I'm privileged enough to be in the I would say top one person of one person on earth uh, of, of being rich right and I'm part of those rich and it's like I worked hard to get there but it's like I feel we need as humanity to close this gap and for me the best way I mean for me like as Pascal with my skills with my personality and stuff like that for me as Pascal Andy um, the, the, the best way I can think of of doing this is to help people being comfortable with technology or in other words we can observe that many people are just not comfortable they are basically in French we say uh, an alphabet technologique I don't know how to say an alphabet in, in English, but you know, like when you have, when you just like have no school, you cannot read, you are an alphabet. And I think building Firepress at, uh, at the moment is one of the best way I can think of doing this because I'm building like a sustainable business where I'm going to bring um, people from all kinds of circles and uh, domains together I'm gonna teach them how to uh, build and use their website and from there I'll be able to teach them all this circle of technology in general 
and I think this is my big vision at the deep of my heart. I want to help society, I want to help people to get there, to be comfortable with technology, to be just like open and not fearful about that. So this is it. I just realized that at the end, this is what I'm building. I'm building Firepress and this is one proxy to get to this big goal of helping humanity bridging the gap between the rich and the poor. Cheers.